Okay, this is a tutorial using a standard Photoshop uh, stock image. I believe this came with Photoshop 5, I can't remember. Um, but basically, what I want to do is create kind of a faux colorization effect. So what I want to do here is first I want to select all and copy. And then I'm going to do this kind of a trick. I'm going to do image mode grayscale make it a black and white and then I'm going to go image mode RGB color. I know that doesn't make much sense but what that gives us is one black and white layer I'm going to change the name of that layer doesn't matter what and then I'm going to paste the copy that we made earlier. So now we have a black and white layer and a color layer. If I move my black and white layer to the top what I can do now is use my eraser and let's make it a little bit larger and maybe start around here and what I'm doing now is I'm just kind of adding this little uh, soft edges here on the flowers and so it looks like only the roses are colored. Now this is a neat little trick um, basically what's happening is I'm erasing the layer with the roses on it so that if I was to say drag this layer you can see that really it's just a layer with holes in it so you can get this really cool little effect there and if you want to add text or something you can use the eyedropper tool pick up one of the colors on the rose you know, maybe a brighter color use your text tool and say um, Valentine's Day. Okay. Let's do the same up here and change my font a little bit. And you can get some nice little cards. In fact, while we're at it, if we go to our layer, layer style, and drop shadow, you can see it adds a nice effect here. In fact, if I also wanted to do a bevel, I just click bevel and emboss and you know I can tell it how much of an emboss I want click OK and I've got a nice little card so I hope that helps